my friends, and welcome back. It is Sunday, April 14th, 2024. I'm the Drunk Pokeru. Tis beer time. It's a beautiful day. It's a mid-teens day, right? It's not like that 25 degree weather you're going to get in, in a month or so. But when the sun shines, it feels beautiful. So you got to sit outside and have a beer. I hope you can. I mean, geez, there's nothing like drinking beer on a patio, isn't there? Or if you get to go someplace and have beer on a patio, that's fine too. But I like drinking at home way better. Why? Better selection of beer than most bars. <laughs> From our pals at Turd Moon. Turd Moon there in Milton. Drinking a lot of Turd Moon beers. But we've drinking a lot of West Coast, double West Coast IPAs. Now we're going to go the other way. Double. New England style IPA. The enemies I've earned. And a few I haven't. Beautiful artwork by Yard Wolves again. Encapsulates everything Third Moon is about. I believe this is Mosaic Galaxy Cashmere and Strata Hops. 8%. A beautiful, you know, it's going to be a big, smooth, tropical thing. You know, I was thinking the other day, there was this discussion about uh, drinking in parks there. And I don't mean getting hammered in a park. I mean having a beer, glass of wine, whatever, when you go to have a picnic. A lot of people don't have backyards. Do you know how lucky we are to have a backyard? A lot of things we got were lucky. And I think to myself, let people have beers in the, in the parks. Why, why not? Why not? Responsible people. Some people don't have backyards. They live in apartments. You should call them togetherments because they're all together. But I digress. That's a different discussion. Where are they going to go to sit outside and soak in that vitamin C? Let's have a beer. Make me happy. Late start. It's 5 o'clock. Not late, but it's my day off. right? It's my, it's my Saturday. I don't work tomorrow. But I don't like to drink too early in the day because then I need a nap. And then it just screws everything up. So I like to take it easy. Every beer tastes 20% better if you drink it outside in the sunshine, which means this is like 120% because it's a third moon beer. Let's get into it. Cheers. You know, every time I think they can't do it, they do it again. They take these hops, they create this beautiful, complex palette of tropical, fruity notes, orange, um, passion fruit, mango... There's a nice resinous part here, berry. It's beautifully pithy, soft, tropical on the finish. It lingers with that kind of pithy citrus bitterness that I love, but it's super accessible. You can see why these beers took off. Like as much as we've been drinking those double West Coast, I got one in the cooler right now. I got a cooler full of beer here, right? I got the Conjuration 22, the double West Coast IPA that, that our third pals of Turd Moon did, and I friggin' love them. But God bless, these beers are great too, man. Like, isn't it awesome that we live in this time when one of the best breweries in Canada can crack out Pilsners, Double West Coast IPAs, Double New England Style IPAs, Bourbon Barrel this, just incredible dark beers, Doppelbox, and they do it so well. So we appreciate that kind of diversity in our beer, but we also appreciate the fact that every single time we're just like, yep, that's great, yep, that tastes like what you said, yep, 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 all right? Poke loves you. Take it easy out there. Enjoy a beer outside if you can today, because you never know what tomorrow will bring. The rain could come, but right now the sun is with us. We're going to have a good time. Cheers. Like, why are they called apartments? They're not apart from anything. Everything's together. But we do drive on the parkway and park in the driveway, so it's a complicated language. 